Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to hopefully resolve the error code 30x8004015 that you were experiencing in Google Chrome. This says that an error occurred while checking for updates, update check failed to start, and then it's a system level error. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process here, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. First thing I recommend doing would be just to go ahead and restart Chrome. So just close out of any open Chrome windows and tabs. And if you have to, you may want to restart your computer as well. And then attempt to launch Google Chrome again and then proceed to check for updates and see if that has then allowed you to proceed with the update. And if that has not worked, something else we can attempt as well, if you want to go ahead and launch Google Chrome. Select the settings icon up at the top right, and then go down and select more tools, and then select clear browsing data. In the time range, click in the drop down and select all time. And you want to make sure cookies and other site data is selected here. Select clear data. And then once that's done, go ahead and close out of Chrome, and then relaunch the browser proceed to check for updates, and then hopefully that has resolved the problem. If you're running a VPN in the background, you may want to consider disabling it and just letting Windows revert back to automatically detecting your network settings. And if you're unsure if you're using a VPN, you can just open up the search menu, type in VPN. Best result should come back with VPN settings. Go ahead and open that up. And if VPN is turned on, you want to go ahead and just toggle to the off position. If there's a VPN connection listed up here, just go ahead and disable that, to at least temporarily, and then check for updates and see if that has resolved the problem. And you can also try and reset Google Chrome as well if you're still having an issue. So if you want to launch Chrome, select the three-dotted icon and over in the top right again. Select Settings. And now select on the left side where it says Advanced. Go ahead and left-click on that. Select Reset and Clean Up. And then underneath Reset and Clean Up, Restore Settings to Original Defaults. So this action will reset Chrome Settings and Chrome Shortcuts, disable extensions, and then delete cookies and other temporary site data. Bookmarks, History, and Saved Passwords won't be affected. I usually take that with a grain of salt. You never know. I would always just make sure you have everything backed up if, if for some reason you needed something. But generally speaking, that should be okay. And usually this is true. I just like to caution anyone whenever you're resetting something and it says that you can save, you know, potentially some files. There's always a chance for data loss, I guess, you know, in a certain sense here. So just keep that in mind. If you want to allow your current settings to be sent to Chrome, you can keep that check marked. Otherwise, you can uncheck that option, depending on your personal preference. And then you want to select Reset Settings. And then once you're done with that, you want to go ahead and close out of Chrome and then relaunch Chrome once again. See if that has resolved the problem. And as one final step, you can actually go ahead through apps and features or the control panel and actually just uninstall Google Chrome and then reinstall it. You know, you can check out a video on my channel on how to uninstall Google Chrome. I have made tutorials of that in the past. You can go ahead and check that out. But that's pretty much it. So, as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. I do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.